Like the video in the next five seconds and watch to the end. Have good luck for the next week. Hey, what's up guys? Perplexify here and in this video, we'll be counting down eight times people took Fortnite to extremes. But make sure to watch till the very end because one Fortnite kid even takes his skills to America's Got Talent and does something very unexpected. But anyways, in our first clip, we have this guy who just takes Fortnite to a new level of extreme as he built a bandage bazooka on Fortnite and literally tries to do Fortnite features in real life. Like in this clip he thinks strangers on the street are his teammates that need reviving and tries to pick them up and revive them. This is definitely scripted but still super funny. But now Fortnite is back and better than ever. Fortnite added this cool new thing where you could carry your teammates to safety so I decided to do some community work and help out around the neighborhood. Oh, that really hurt. Don't worry little man I'm gonna carry you to safety okay? What are you doing? I gotta get you out of the store just be quiet. Number seven, the same guy is back, but he does another crazy thing by tattooing his shoulder with a heart, and in the middle of the heart, it has Tifu in it. But that's not it. He also tries to sell Chug Jug drinks on the street like a lemonade stand, and you guys just gotta see what happens when he tries this. The last time you guys interviewed me, I made the mistake of getting a Fortnite tattoo. And well, after giving it some thought, I decided to get another one. <laughs> It says Tifu with the heart around it because I love Tifu. <laughs> um, the artist did spell it wrong, but it's fine. I could always fix it. Okay, here he tries to sell Chug Jug drinks on the street. Oh, hi, little buddy. How can I help you? May I have one Slurp Juice, please? One Slurp Juice coming right up. Thank you. Ew, that tastes like hot dog water, I want a refund. And that's your undeveloped taste buds talking, kid. This is the best slurp juice in the three block radius, so no refunds, buddy. Number six, we have some guy who took Fortnite so far, he actually got on the news for it. So I guess this guy named Gavin was playing so much Fortnite, his mom started to get worried about him and saying that she noticed personality changes. She then contacted the news team to make the issue more public and it's just crazy what happens at the end. The story of how the Fortnite frenzy can impact family life. Gavin's mom notices a change in her kids when they play for too long. You can just sort of tell that their attitude gets a little bit more short. They can be a little more just cranky. Both moms make sure their kids keep a great balance and make sure schoolwork and chores are done before they are rewarded with any screen time. Number five, we have this kid named William who really likes Fortnite and I guess the whole family does too because they end up getting a Fortnite themed Monopoly game. But it ends horribly wrong because one of the family members rage quits the game because they were losing. But what's absolutely insane is when he goes outside to get a pickaxe and you won't believe what he does with it. Watch till the end. Give me my freaking no, Give me my Okay, here's the part he goes and grabs a pickaxe, and he must think he's living in Fortnite with what he does next. No, you gave you him just take just can't handle You loose. needed to give him three tokens, and you- I did give him three tokens! Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Oh Stop! Oh Stop! Oh Stop! Oh Stop! Oh Okay, they go into a wrestling match here and never try any of this, but this whole situation is nuts. Number four, we have this Fortnite addicted kid who plays Fortnite over 12 hours a day. Basically, as soon as he gets back from school, he plays all the way till he sleeps. This guy takes Fortnite to extremes for sure, but what he says at the end will shock you. You know, what else is there to do? I go to school for six hours a day, five days a week. As soon as I get home, it's Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite. What's wrong with me, but... It's kind of cool. I only text and socialize with people in between games because if I did it in a game, then I could die and 
and I could ruin my KD. For five minutes a day, I do go outside and do a bit of Fortnite meditation, which helps me, which helps me concentrate to get that win. Whenever I do this, I get over three solo wins a day. I think the cameraman got some clips of me doing that. Early. Let me know in the comments how many hours of Fortnite you play, but this next part reveals something shocking he does. I meditate, I come here three times a day, and just get myself in the zone. I'll show you where I do my business. So I just sit on this chair, the controller, and I just practice finger movements and stuff. Um, it's really, really cool actually. I just, I find it relaxing and stuff like that. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna do my meditation. All right, so I'm done now. Um, really good session today actually. Um, but I'm not gonna play some more. Number three, we have this kid who was playing Fortnite for over 48 hours straight. Now that is just insane to me, but the problem is his roommates are trying to get him to stop and it just goes horribly wrong. Never try anything like this, but you guys gotta keep watching till the last clip. He's been playing Fortnite for a total of 48 hours now. It's I've literally been 48 hours 48 straight. hours. He hasn't gotten off at all. And he told us not to film this time, but obviously we're gonna. Yeah. So we here's where they try to get him off. Dave, it's time to get off, buddy. I'm not getting off. You can say what you want. You can do what you want. Dude, you I'm look just... gross, dude. Like physically gross. Oh my god. You, get the camera dude, out of my you're face. so sweaty. This, okay. I know I've been on for a little bit. But it, ha how, how long do you think it has been? I've been, I've been. I mean, just looking at him, it looks like he's been playing for days straight. Gotta get off, dude. It's not, it's really Stop. time to get off. Stop that. Dude, you're wet. He is wet Stop to it. the touch. No, I'm not. The, yo, put the. Okay, if you're Dude, gonna your film, hair is off. so greasy. You no, know, that is. Dude, that is wet and like slimy and. I think they're. Dude, please stop. I know this is the one I'm gonna win because this is the first time I've been down to 39 in like three games. <laughs> three <laughs> games? No, this is the first time you don't know to 39. Oh my God. Number two, we have this kid who takes Fortnite to extremes because he made a real life chug jug. And the funniest thing is, he pretty much drinks it around the same time it takes someone in Fortnite to finish a chug jug too. He must have been injured or something and wanted to heal up, but this is so funny. You wanna have a drink shield real fast in Fortnite? Here we have our shield juice, a little mug. This is about the equivalent of a medium shield. So let's uh, chug this. In our final clip, we have this edited video of a kid who goes on America's Got Talent and starts performing a song called Chug Jug With You. Now, this has got to be one of the greatest Fortnite meme material there is, and it's just unbelievable that this exists on the internet, but you guys got to see the ending. What are you going to be performing for us today? Another original? Yeah, it's about, like, just how fast everything's been happening since the audition. Well, we can't wait to hear it. Good luck, Patches. Oh, thank you. So guys, he's about to sing, but watch till the end because it's just hilarious. If you made it this far, you are officially awesome. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and make sure to check out my other videos. See you guys.